Hi, I'm Justin Hartley from Smallville, and this is CW Connect. When I was a kid, I, uh, I actually did think about, you know, being an actor. I didn't think of it as a job. It wasn't something that I thought of as, like, you know, something that you could do for a living. Um, I didn't I didn't have that mindset, but I always admired actor and actors and liked actors and comedians especially so yeah I kind of thought about it a little bit but The first time I walked on the set of Smallville um, It was a little bit intimidating because these guys have been together for so long and uh, plus you're kind of working with Superman So it was a little intimidating, but um, quickly got acclimated and um, it's just kind of been exciting ever since so uh, intim intimidated for like three minutes and then ever since this has been fun. My favorite experience so far during my run on Smallville has probably been getting to know the cast um, uh, off like outside the, their characters. It's interesting to see how different people are uh, from the characters that they play. It's probably been the most, most fun, most interesting uh, part about it. My music tastes are pretty eclectic. I like jazz, I like blues, I like, uh, I'm a big rap fan, I'm a heavy metal fanatic, I like, um, like modern rock, alternative stuff, I like pretty much everything. Besides acting, my greatest passion in life, well right now it's kind of changed, right now it would be, um, I have a daughter so it would be making sure that my daughter grows up to be just exactly like me, uh, like a little clone. Um, other than, no I'm kidding, it, it would be, yeah, making sure that my daughter grows up to be like you know a good person whatever that means you can't help but kind of get um, get into the character a little bit as you're putting on the tight uncomfortable thick warm leather all over your body growing up my favorite superhero was Ozzy Smith he played shortstop for the St. Louis Cardinals I thought he was a superhero he's I thought I mean I really did think that he was um, I didn't think he was human. I thought he was like a god. But uh, but typical superhero, it have to be Superman. You know, Superman stands for for everything. Everything that's great. So that would be my favorite. Man, working with Erica is great. She's um, she's a very sweet person, uh, very professional, uh, and good at her job. Working with Michael is uh, is wonderful. He's he has you laughing the entire day. Um, but he's also able to like f like shut it down and focus when when the camera's rolling. But he is an absolute riot. And uh, Tom's our leader. Tom is um, it's interesting because you know he plays Superman on the show, um, but he's 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 the leader. When he's there, it's like you know you can tell that he's he's in, he's kind of you know in charge of, of uh, um, or has has a has a handle on how things are going and 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 kind of you know leads us. So it's interesting. Yeah, um, you know, it, it, it being far, being far away from home is one of the drawbacks to this job. Um, you know, obviously, I'd like it if they filmed it in my you know living room. I, I don't know, I wouldn't like all the people there. You know what I mean? But uh, but it'd be fun. It'd be fun to have it like at home or closer to home. It's one of the drawbacks. But um, but I do. You know, there are planes, and I get to go home on the weekends and stuff like that. Plus, Vancouver's such a beautiful city, so it's not it's not like they dump me off in some you know some, in the middle of nowhere. Uh, you know. People from Vancouver are great, Canadians are great, the city's great. But yeah, I'd like to be closer home. It is tough. Sometimes it's tough. But I'm going home today. All right, everyone, thanks for all the great questions. Make sure you tune in for Smallville Thursday nights at 8 o'clock on the CW.